2013 was a magical year for Red Deer College Athletics with three national titles and a narrow miss on a fourth. So now the question is, what do you do for an encore? Uh, you know, I've probably been asked that question 30 times, to be honest with you. And my, I guess when I'm trying to be funny, I just say you win more championships. All kidding aside, the college has adopted the philosophy that excellence is a verb. I really think you just try every single day to be as good as you possibly can be. You try to improve as much as you possibly can and you be as professional as what is humanly possible. We ask from our athletes and you know what, then you just see where the results end. The coaches and athletes returning might feel a little heat trying to follow in these giant footsteps, but Hansen says that's not the case. He says pressure is a privilege. We talked a lot with our athletes about when you're good, uh, there's expectations. When there's expectations, there's, there's pressure, and that's good. So uh, I think that, yeah, there's pressure, and I would hate to think that there wasn't because when there, when there, is, uh, when there is an expectation, I don't think people perform. Well, these student athletes not only succeed in the sports arena, but also in the classroom. Many RDC athletes were also national scholars in 2013. They're good students and they're good people in the community. I think they're wonderful leaders. And uh, you know what, I think it would be a pretty hollow victory for us if we just left with uh, championships as opposed to better people. Fair warning to the rest of the teams in the ACAC, that dream year will go a long way to attracting more top caliber athletes to make RDC that much stronger. There's zero doubt that the success of our program leads to the success of our program. And like I said, it's a snowball effect. So we've had a phenomenal recruiting year on just about all of our sports this year. So I expect we're going to be pretty good again. For Go Central, I'm Jim Claggett.